There's a very unfortunate incident that happened mm-hmm. um, in a school called Dooni in Kitui. So the parents were upset about the poor results that their stud- that their that their children mm-hmm. um, gave last last year, okay. and so they re- they decided to go to the school and r- remove their frustration there at the school. Mm-hmm. Okay, so mm-hmm. they went to make noise at the teacher. Yes. Now, the sad part is when they were talking to the teacher, this teacher was actually on her way to take her kids to school, mm-hmm. a female teacher. Yes. The parents decided to lynch this teacher. I... As in, mm-hmm. while you decide to chapa, baka waka I know. And it doesn't end there, guys. Mm-hmm. Waka choma. Now, I want to remind you why the parents went to the school. While you say, how could uh, uh, give good results? The exams and so waka decide ku ingilia umwali mumoja. Now I'm trying to understand. Can you can you fast forward Monday for these kids? I'm a Leo for these students. When you uko shule, unafanya exam. I mean unafanya class, mzazi ya mekutuma shule. Alafu hauja perform poor. Aka decide ku umwali mwako. How can you go on with school? It's impossible for you to go on with school. Wa au maparo walitaka umwali mu afanya exams for the kids. I don't understand. So right now there's children who were there witnessing mm-hmm. their their parent being lynched by other children's parents. Mm-hmm. But if the parents can do something that's this dumb, how about the kids? Yani, what hours as in domaduanzi? Hours as in domaduanzi. I cannot I, I don't understand how you can un- unleash your your anger towards a teacher who hasn't done anything wrong to your children. Yes. You see, if she, if she was like maybe v- uh, violating them, mm-hmm. you'd understand. Yes. But like she's taught, she's done her part. Yeah, in school should be teachers 25%, yes. students 75 And parents, where do parents kick in? As you are seeing your pa- your child's grades going lower, what what did you do to mitigate this? Unafikiri mwalimu ni kila kitu? Vibes Radio, we rule the nation in this generation. Kitui, um, let me just give you an update. TSC, of course, has uh, withdrawn six other teachers who are teaching in that school. Okay. Um, two people have been arrested and arraigned in court yesterday. And uh, we will be updating you on how that case goes. So, in case you've just tuned in, mm. there's a teacher who was lynched and burned to death uh, by the parents because uh, the parents were upset that their students or their, their kids did not uh, give good results last year. And so, we're asking, why the hell would you even go... Why would you why would you go that extra mile to do something absolutely insane? And uh, Robbie on my Instagram says, but Kwambok, some public school teachers are arrogant and that's why parents are angry. They take their children to private school and that's what and that's inhuman. I mean, I don't blame the parents sometimes. I got to say Robbie, I completely 1000%. Is there a million percent? I feel a billion. What's the largest <laughs> the largest number? Infinity percent. Disagree with you. I disagree with you. Okay. I keep saying it right here. There's different there's better ways to deal with your anger. And if as a community we continue to allow ourselves to give excuses as to why we result in violence, mm-hmm. you're just raising another generation. Imagine those kids now in that school. Um toi are in the high school. That's primary school. Yes. Um toi and high school. Mm-hmm. I get bad results. Ndio. Mwalimu amu ama mwalimu amwambie we, mbona umekuja to school late? Um toi anaweza do nini? Setembe tu paro yake we, hebu enda. Wacha na tena paro yake. Asha ona kenye paro yake midu. Mm-hmm. Ako primary school. Ndio. So this kid can actually know that this is how we deal with things. He'll actually organize a lynching to that teacher who's That's going what I'm to saying. Punish. It's not the it's not even the first time we've seen us uh, students actually, you know, being being violent towards the teacher. I'm not saying that there are no problems in this country. But violence, when did we reach this place where Brayot Kiongea, mm-hmm. yesterday, you remember the front page of the newspaper yesterday? There was a lady, uh, a mother of four. Yes. She's 29 years old. I won't forget the story because it was just ridiculous. Mother of four, 29, and she stabbed all four children. The older one is 13, mm-hmm. the younger one is nine. So she was asked, why did you do it? She said, she had a disagreement with the with the with the, with the baby daddy, mm-hmm. who's not helping her take care of these children, and she doesn't have any means, so she stabbed them. Just yesterday, again, there was another story of a, a 25-year-old who who poisoned her two children mm-hmm. because she had an ag- argument with her man. Yes. How many times have we seen these stories? Violence is becoming a crutch. 
when you cannot communicate. You want to tell me a bunch of parents? Muli toka kwa manyumba zenu. Mojo ina kusema tuende tumjome and you thought that was a good idea? Plus remember yesterday we also mentioned kids who are doing the same thing that they are watching the parents doing. Thank you. A kid actually slashed and de- uh, and killed um a fellow st- classmate yeah. surely a kid when you class 8 then even two days uh two weeks ago yeah. we also mentioned of a kid when you leenda home akachukua kisu akakam akastab nini mtu beshte yake you a small disagreement yeah. just because umse ali decide by the way he ball ni yangu mimi sikupati akam stab so chances are very high that children out there are also watching, watching. what kids out there are also doing yeah. and even what their parents are doing yeah. and their chances are very high that they are going to emulate yeah. what they are going to do oh absolutely consolata primary yeah. in the story to chapa last week yeah uh, last, year, last, year. last year yes these kids i mean so guys as this as we tell you this story and as we communicate on this story me all i'll say is i will continue to advocate for kama unaskia hasira juu ya kitu kama kuna kitu imekukera that's not the time you run towards that thing kwenda kuiongezea hasira unanisikiza that's not the time ati ah umesikia vinyo brai amekuja alafu hiyo hasira yote unabeba naelekea brai you're not going to sort out anything those parents should have taken a moment discussed amongst themselves come up with a solution and then gone to the teacher to now discuss even do tunataka how can we be able to come up with a solution but they were going there premeditated mm-hmm. walikuwa wanataka kwenda kutolewa mama hasira yeah. na hasira hasara Sir.